Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, and good night, everybody. Welcome back to some more Super Mario Maker 2. The last episode, we finished off most of the second uh, floor for the main area. Now we need a couple more coins to get started on the third floor. We also had a couple of tr a little bit of trouble with the uh, toads. So needed a couple of resources. Managed to plant some trees, and they actually look pretty good. But I'm not sure how sturdy they are. Someone tried climbing all all of my trees over clearing this course. Veteran carpenter should go after doing the handstand on all twelve trees. Take care out there. All right, let's do this. I guess that is one way to. That's how sturdy a tree is if someone can climb it. But it, it, I feel like it ended in a pretty big disaster if the tree was not sturdy. I guess we don't think about that. Okay, hammer bros. That's not a hammer bros, it's a fire bros. Oh, that's a lot of bros. I don't even know what that one is called. Some of the big dudes that do the big brown pounds. Alright, let's get out of here. Oh, it was a 10 coin. And I want the 10 coin. I need to climb up on this one first. There we go. Come on. Oh no. Okay, it's fine. Ah, uh, well. Uh, I don't think we recover from this, do we? Oh, okay, they just disappear. Uh, please get on there, Mario. There we go. There we go. Level complete. Tested out all the trees. They're all pretty sturdy. You want jobs? I got jobs. Plenty of cheap cheeps in the sea. So I kind of went overboard with the cheap cheeps, and now there's way too many of them. Not really sure what's going on anymore. Is it impossible to beat this? Someone, help me out here. Ocean aficionado. Overpopulating. Nah, there's uh, quite a bit of them. These guys can be underwater as well. Oh, okay. Okay, they follow a path, at least. Ah, these guys don't follow a path. They just go straight forward. They don't care. Spinies. Or spiny eggs, I should say. Okay. One go lower. Checkpoint. Is this is the first water level. This is actually the first water level. Okay, what is up with the wigglers? What? 
I mean, never pictured a Wiggler being underwater, but... Oh, no. There we go, got them all. Go! There we go. A hundred coins. Perfect. Cheap, cheap swimming in the back over there. Man, I always like the uh, the backgrounds and underwater levels. They're always so, always so pretty to look at. Thousand seven hundred. All oh, right, I forgot. The whole point was to get my money to upgrade these. This thing over here. Yes, I am. Good building. I have hammers, oh no. Only there's many help very many jobs. Oh we okay, there's more jobs, thank you. Uh fire koopa clown carnage, snake blocks in the sky or fish in the before that's a lot, so Okay. Fire Koopa Clown Carnage. The Fire Koopa Clown Car is ready for its grand expedition. Press hold Y to supercharge fireballs that can blast hard blocks. I go in the spaceship myself, but I uh need to do some laundry. Yeah. Honestly, that's a fair excuse. Important to do your laundry. Can always just be putting it off. Ultimate defense. Whoa. Come on, there we go. Whoa. I forgot it. Yeah, I can just do that. Ah, I can't do that anymore. Wait, no. Car back. Thank you, platforms. Uh, get rid of these guys. Get immune. Just go. Ah, it's not good. There goes my triple fireball. Ah, uh, there goes my mushroom. I can't fit through there, what? There you go. Oh, if I had the spiny... Uh, the spiny helmet, I could get up there. Sad. But, we still got the quest complete. Or the job complete. One part done. Alright, more jobs. Snake blocks in the sky. I made a snake block test area for people who are skeptical of snake blocks. Try out for yourself and experience a feature of public transportation. Snake block enthusiasts. Well, from what I know of snake blocks, is they're, they're pretty... They're a pretty big pain to follow. 
As public transportation? I don't know. I am a bit skeptical, but I mean, if you say so. Like, I'm like here, like, we're just wasting so much snake block energy just doing all these turns. To be fair, I don't know, maybe these turns do have a purpose. Maybe there's something I'm missing out. I mean, that guy is the snake block expert, I'm not. been the same. I guess I would have gotten three more coins if so I went the uh black pool route. But I still would have gotten ten coins from that and check out the gun. That was good enough. I guess I could have gotten both of them, but nah. Twenty percent. We're almost a third of the way done with this castle. We're fishing the forest. Yeah, <laughs> I flooded the forest and the cheap cheeps love it. Think you can make it to the end and earn your paycheck? Why are you- what are you paying me for exactly? <laughs> oh, just to get- just to, okay, you just get to the end of the forest, but like, why? Why would you do that? Oh, that is certainly flooded. These Yoshis can swim. Like, Alumba does not look happy. Or maybe he does look happy. Yeah, I mean, they kinda- they kinda swim around. Ah, oh, Yoshi, no. Okay, come on, Yoshi. Calm down. Calm down. Okay. Down we go. Take the mushroom. Oh, no. Okay, we're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. We're on the other where I am. There I am. Go. There we go. And we drop. Boom. Ten coins. Pretty easy level. To be fair, it was like one star. Alright. Bub the clouds beyond the vines. Here's a course that's got vines growing all over it. If you want to know what lies beyond the vines, be my guest. Lonely farmer. Alright. Let's check it out then. No, it's been a while since one of these. Alright. Let's see. Ooh. Oh, okay. Thank you, game, for being a little lenient with me, because I would have certainly died there. Okay. What am I doing? Okay. There we go. Why is there a hole there? Fire flower. Plum. I forgot the dogs can go to the side. Big one. Oh, I don't want to get a 
chance to use this. Or the lack of two at least. Okay, that guy throws bombs. Get out of here. You're throwing... Chain chomps? Okay, well... Not very nice. Hopefully I didn't, didn't need that. I needed that. I don't know, like probably uh, maybe a coin over there. Well, how high does this go up? Pretty high up. I didn't realize you could go to the end. I forgot that's a thing that can happen. I thought it'd be like uh, you just it does an invisible wall. I think we can build uh, another of the halls now. Up uh, can. Uh, sure, let's do this all again. There we go. We're gonna start it on the top floor too. You gotta treasure cover your jobs. More jobs. It looks like you get jobs every time you complete a or you start construction. Goomba Clubhouse. I love Goombas. I love them so much that I made them a clubhouse. Aren't they just so cute when they scoot around or they scoot through these clear pipes? Please go hang out with them. I'll pay you. Hey, why didn't you why didn't you hang out with them yourself? Why are you paying someone else to hang out with the Goombas you like? <laughs> It even makes sense. Because they don't have time to do it, I guess. I thought I was gonna get killed. How do you even get in there? Okay. Yeah, it's kinda scary having the Goomba just going so fast towards you like that. No, my mushroom! We gotta find more. There you go. I mean, I'll try not to kill any of the Goombas. They're just, they're just kind of chilling around. Hmm, this is not where we want to go right now. I got to pass through. Go. Here we go. Okay, we got the key. Oh, is that the intended method to get that? Okay, well, this is a very hard jump to different up here, by so. I think I missed anything too big. Let's just go. There we go. Ten coins acquired. Can play. Let's go. Now we're a third of the way done. Oh man. Oh, this is bad. Big red. We got a problem. Shouldn't say this out loud. So here. 
Oh, uh, wait, the toad got missing? Ah, Ray got kidnapped while we were taking an unauthorized break. <laughs> Please bring Red back before the chief notices or we're all busted. Ah. Just to go with one toad and toe. Thanks in the bands. You sport toads. Oh? Mario Galaxy music? Okay. There's that. There he is. What are you doing in outer space? How'd you even get to outer space? Okay. Flying fish. But to be fair, they're not flying. There's just no gravity. There's little to no gravity. 30. Okay. Oh! Okay, they can get killed. Just it is very difficult for them. Ooh. I keep forgetting. I keep over. I overshot it again because I forgot that there's no invisible wall. Okay. Well, we got 70 coins, which isn't that bad. Now he's back. Rescued Red Toad. That's progressing. Alright. Yeah. So look the chief notice. Good. Keep grabbing those coins, Big Red. You want jobs? I got jobs. Oh yeah, we definitely that's a lot of jobs, jeez. Uh boost towering house of terror. That's a lot. There's so many. Okay. The new business venture. I'm creating a haunted house. I'm putting together a focus group to test it. I'll give you a prize when you make it out alive. Or rather, if you make it out alive. Mwahahaha. The game master. Well, you don't really want people to die in one of your attractions. I guess if there's like a waiver that's signed. And people know what they're getting into, I guess. It, it is legal then, but still... It's not very good. Because it would just be no better than those haunted houses. I forgot that they did that. Uh, I even saw it. I was like, yeah, I'm gonna just run through, but nope, they move too fast for you to just run across them. Just gotta keep going back and forth. It's fine. They can't get me. I think about it, are there even ghost houses in Super Mario Bros. 3? There, there is definitely booze. But I don't think there's ghost houses. I can't remember any if there was. To be fair, a lot of the SMB3 castles were basically ghost houses with how tricky some of them were. Mushroom. Okay. Money. Okay, well, 
not get booze from some of them. It's not good. That's definitely not good. Those boosts have wings. I'm assuming that just means they go faster. I did the whole back and forth technique. Oh yeah, they blew very fast. There we go. Take it. 90 coins isn't bad. There we go. Probably won't check again until I have enough to build the West Hall. That requires a lot of money. Let's do one more. Big showdown on a little star. Anyone receives this transmission, please send help. Bowser Jr. has invaded this small planet, and we require assistance. The gravity's odd here, but you can still hold the B while bouncing off the enemies. To do a super jump, please stomp Bowser Jr. into submission. Stargazer. Have fun! Oh, okay. Okay, I barely, barely made it. Oh no, this is not fun. <laughs> what is this? <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh no. Gonna be precise. The moon? What is the moon? I'm assuming that works like the sun. I don't want. Okay, never mind. What? They helped me. What is going on? Okay, I guess the moon is good and the sun is evil. Pepper <laughs> Bros got very high jumps as well. Oh, there's Bowser Jr. Bowser Jr. Sprite does look looks pretty good, honestly. Again, they did a really good job with the uh, making sprites that weren't originally in the games feel like they are from the games. Got a nice little tower done. Yeah, that's gonna be it for me. Thank you guys very much for watching. I'll see you all next time for another video. See ya.